Defensively, they came in, you knew they were the best three-point shooting team coming into this game. They hit 12 of them, started really hot, just too big of a hole to, to try to climb out of. Mm -hmm. you like? uh, no, I, I don't think so. I just think uh, lack of communication in our zone and lost the Curries, so to speak, in our zone. And, I mean, just didn't really have the fight to get stops when we were down big and to cut that margin down, I guess. Yeah. Um, with I know so, there's so many new guys in the rotation with all the injuries and stuff you guys have dealt with, but you guys have played for each other for a little while. Are you surprised that there's so many breakdowns still with the communication and the rotations defensively? Uh, I mean, yeah, I guess. It's just, I mean, it's frustrating just because we do such a, a great job of scouting teams. Um, it's frustrating. Uh, even I find myself doing yeah. something that's the opposite of what our scout does, and then I, it's just kind of mental lapse, I guess, that we need to get rid of, so. So, uh, you speak mentally, but is there something more to that, or, or why do you think that y'all aren't trans making the transition from practice to, to games defensively? I have, I wish I knew. I have no, I have no clue. Yeah. Um, off offensively, another game, slow struggle. Um, the 54 points, I guess it was, just without, outside of JJ and you, not, not a whole lot of contributions. How do you get more guys involved? Uh, I think just keep pumping confidence into them and just letting them know that to trust their abilities to score and that, I mean, make or miss that, I mean, we just, we need, we need to, you know, with our limited amount and number of people, we need a, everyone we can get. So, I mean, we need, Inch of contribution would be would be great, but I mean, I just think keep keeping a great teammate and keep telling him to shoot the ball with confidence. And I mean, it's just one day it, it'll click. So with the losses piling up this way, I mean, obviously there's obviously some frustration. You see that amongst you guys on the court. Just what's the confidence level for right now? Uh, I just think I think we're not really worried about the wins and losses. We're just worried about trying to be the best that we can be uh, as a team and try to grow in areas of defense transition, rebounding, and uh, limiting our turnovers. And I think that's all we, that's what we're really trying to focus on. And I think those three aspects uh, will help us get some wins. What, what was the mood like in the locker room afterward? What, what's kind of the mood in the locker room after games right now? What, what are you guys saying to each other? I mean, just kind of, that we need, the coaches are giving us plenty of information that we just need to just find a way to take it from practice, to film, to executing it on the court. So. Yeah, do, do you still, in your mind, do you still see youth and, and some of the inexperiences as uh, kind of I mean, yeah. Is I that mean, an issue it, still? It, uh, I don't know. Uh, it's just, I mean, some guys are new to the Mountain West playing, yeah. myself included. And, you know, it's the Mount West is a pretty good conference. So I mean, we can't. Our margin there is very small, so we need to limit limit it all of the errors to kind of eventually help us get away. Do you think? Because it sounds like you're saying that these things are correctable. Like you guys can do it. So do yeah. you feel like that you guys are capable of turning this thing around at, at all going forward? Absolutely. Yeah. I uh, I think once once we all just kind of uh, click. I think we'll be we'll be more than five. Yeah. yeah.